Hello, today I would like to talk about an animal called the marine iguana. The cool thing about this animal is that if you see in the picture, you see it might have some salt in its face. Well, that's because it this is the only marine lizard in the entire world. And not only that, but it, it can be underwater only for a limited time. But that limited time can be up to 30 minutes underwater. Not only that, but it can... It can swim deep, as deep, more than 65 feet underwater, or more than 20 meters underwater. That's pretty cool. Not only that, but they have scent glands. They also have no nasal glands. So whenever they're swimming in the water and salt gets in those glands, they can just, sne they can just sneeze it out of their nose. Any questions? Do they have any predators? Well, Snake, they do. Their predators, for as an example, can be hawks and birds of prey. Whenever they are about to give birth or when they are younger, they are more vulnerable and they are more of an easy target for birds of prey and hawks to eat. Any more? How fast are they? Well, slithering reptile with no limbs, they can run up to 1.5 body lengths per second. Any more questions? What does this have to do with the Bible? That's a super good question, no limbs. Actually, I would like to share with you a scripture found in the Bible at Genesis 1 verse 21. It talks about how Jehovah created animals that live in the sea and also on land. But we, we see with this marine iguana, they can live both underwater and on water. And they're the only living, they're the only living lizard, marine lizard in the entire world. So we see that Jehovah, he really makes things without for our enjoyment because he cares about us. Me and Nolims are best friends, aren't we? Yes, we are.